Dancing with the Stars Season 31 Halloween Night marks the return of team dances after skipping two seasons due to the COVID-19 pandemic. Team dances were introduced in DWTS Season 7 in 2008 and were a staple on the show through Season 28 in 2019. However, due to the fact that the couples had to be separated due to pandemic protocols, rehearsals and performances for team dances were impossible in seasons 29 and 30. Dancing with the Stars Season 31 will revive this exciting tradition, which brings together the contestants in two mesmerizing group dances. For the DWTS Halloween Night Team Dances, the remaining nine couples will be split into two groups. The panel, Carrie Ann Anaba, Lynn Goodman, Derek Huff, and Bruno Tonioli will judge the dances, and the stars on each team will all receive the same score. Those points will then be combined with their scores from their individual Halloween night routines performed earlier in the episode. The DWTS contestants are divided into two teams according to Gold Derby. On DWTS Halloween night, the nine remaining couples will perform in two separate teams. Team Wicked is made up of five couples, Vinny Guadagnino and Coco Iwasaki, Shangela and Gleb Savchenko, Heidi Demelio and Artem Chigvintsev, Jordan Sparks and Brandon Armstrong, and Gabby Wendy and Alan Burstyn. Gabby's regular partner Val Chemerkovsky tested positive for COVID-19, and will not be able to dance. Gabby has tested negative. Team Wicked will dance to the witches are back from Hocus Pocus 2. The other DWTS team, Team Scream, has four couples, Charlie D'Amelio and Mark Ballas, Wayne Brady and Whitney Carson, Daniel Durant and Britt Stewart, and Trevor Donovan and Emma Slater. They will dance to Heads Will Roll by Ya yeah, Ya yeah, Ya's. DWTS team dances are interesting because they can help or hurt contestants depending on who is on the team. Team Wicked's Vinny has found himself at the bottom of the DWTS leaderboard many times, but his team has two of the strongest competitors, Heidi and Gabby. This could help him because he could earn more points, especially if his individual routine score is low. Additionally, Gabby is at a disadvantage this week because she is not dancing with her regular partner, Val. The team dance might aid her as well. The other team, Team Scream, has two competitors, Charlie and Wayne, who have consistently been at the top of the leaderboard. Charlie has placed first every week so far. Although Wayne's scores slipped last week due to his lack of rehearsal time with Whitney because of his illness, he is still considered a frontrunner in the competition. This team could help Trevor and Daniel, who often end up somewhere in the middle of the pack. Unfortunately, the weaker members of these teams could also potentially bring down the best dancers if they do not perform well. Much like the DWTS Week 5 Dance Marathon, the team dances make it easier for fans to compare the contestants' abilities as they work together to perform. It would have been fun to see Heidi and Charlie, who are mother and daughter, dance together, but they are on different teams. It is always exhilarating to see what the professional dancers create together. The DWTS Season 31 cast is very supportive of each other, so it will be thrilling to see them collaborate on these Halloween night team dances. Dancing with the Stars streams Mondays at 8 p.m. Eastern Time on Disney+. Source, Gold Derby.